Hey YouTube, I'm here to show you a tutorial on how to make bamboo grip tape. A request I got from someone like this. So yeah, let's get started. What you'll need is uh, something to measure with. An uh, exacto knife, razor blade I mean, or uh, scissors. I prefer scissors, it's easier to cut with. Grip tape, obviously. Yeah, Alright, so the first thing we're going to want to do, is you're going to want to measure out your, the width that you want it. Now my width is one and a half inches. So that's about as wide as this big one right here. One and a half inches, which I think is a good size. And then, uh, so then uh, you all send you something to write with. Then I just took a green sharpie and I drew my line down following the ruler. And then next, what you're going to want to do is cut out a rectangle. Uh, however tall you want it this one is three inches and so that's three inches so you can cut it out whatever height you want I think three inches is a good height so you're just gonna, gonna cut that you're just gonna wanna cut that out like this and then next you're gonna wanna take your sharpie and you're gonna going to want to draw these U kinda things I'll show you on the side that they're going to make the curves of the bamboo. Like that. See how they curve, side curves of the bamboo. The next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to make the curves on the top and the bottom. Make sure these curves are both going the same way. So, it should look like that. Like, this one's rounded up, like, rounding around something like that, and so is this one. It's not going the opposite way. So make sure you do that. Then you're going to want to cut it out, and it should look like this. See what I mean? Around the same way. Then, uh, after that, if you have a board that has spray-on grip tape, like mine does, then you're going to want to, uh, take a piece of grip tape, like a small piece, like an extra piece or something, or uh, sandpaper and you're going to want to sand down right where you're going to put it so like I, I sanded down right where, right around here and here and then I stuck it on and it was fine it still stays and then uh, for the stems what I did for that is I used the little pieces that I cut off from this side piece I just used those as stems and I maybe trimmed them up a bit and I just put them on like that and then for leaves, I just kind of freehand drew a leaf onto a piece of grip tape and cut that out. That's not that complicated. Now, if you want to do something like the panda that I have, that's a little bit more complicated. Uh, what you're going to want to do, well, what I did is I went to Google, and I just typed in panda logo, and I found, like, some, I think it was called AMF, their panda logo for their company. And so uh, I just freehand drew that onto... A chunk of grip tape and then I cut that cut it out sanded this area down and put it on so that's pretty much it it's really easy so uh, yeah thanks for watching comment rate and subscribe and if you do this post a video response and let me see it